At this time, the humans were finally able to leave the core of the Earth, where they were hidden away for several centuries to survive the radiations left by the last atomic conflicts. At the heart of the jungle, they discovered the Buzooks, a race of mutants who were living peacefully at the foot of a hill. The humans took possession of these places by force and built a city on the hill called Vrxtnxl. But the problem is, indeed, it's lots at Vrxtnxl. <laughs> Oh, Professor Azimuth, do we play with dolls now? Stars everywhere. What happened to me? <laughs> Ouch! What's this word snibble that keeps popping up? Uh, yes, sir. That house behind us. Who does it belong to? It belongs to Professor Asimov. He is a respected man known for his scientific work on time. Something must have happened here tonight. And can you tell me who I am? I don't know you. I've never seen you around here before. what it's used for. If I were able to read, I'd figure out how it works. Dear friend, have you heard about the Schnibble yet? The Schnibble? Of course. It's thanks to him that the best things can happen. Professor Azimuth discovered him for everybody's well-being. What happened in this house? I can't remember anything. I didn't see anything, but I heard that J.F. Sebastian knows about it. Yeah. 
I've never seen you around here before. Have you paid all your taxes? Burka must be a local delicacy. There's a nice bazook cut that I'd love to put my hands on. It's not safe to go that way. There are roadblocks and I don't have my ID. It's not safe to go that way. There are roadblocks and I don't have my ID. It's not safe to go that way. There are roadblocks and I don't have my ID. There's a nice bazook cut that I'd love to put my hands on. Ah, looks like boots. Good. I'd like to wear something on my feet. If I were able to read, I'd figure out how it works. Oh. You pay tax on sudation and body odor? Uh. Oh. And the tax on dust created by moving around? Uh. And the tax on shadows, created by your body mass. Uh, uh, <laughs> and the tax on pollution, created by your gluttonous and putrid breathing. Uh, <laughs> Come closer, you have something there. <laughs> Who's this J.F. Sebastian? I've never heard of him before. J.F. Sebastian? An intellectual who makes the rounds of literary salons. You'll find him at the Wino's bar. Yes, sir. That house behind us. Who does it belong to? It belongs to Professor Asimov. He's a respected man known for his scientific work on time. Something must have happened here tonight. 
And can you tell me who I am? I don't know you. I've never seen you around here before. It's not safe to go that way. There are roadblocks and I don't have my ID. It's not safe to go that way. There are roadblocks and I don't have my ID. Must be a local delicacy.